A really great way to show your clients that you really appreciate them is to have, well, a client appreciation event. In this week's video, I'm going to share with you nine, nine things that you need to know when putting on a successful client appreciation event. Hey, it's Michael Creasy here, the executive editor with Agent Inner Circle from agentinnercircle.com. This week's episode, it's about nine different things that you can do to enhance your client appreciation event to make it a home run. And it's contributed by our good friend, author, trainer, uh, coach, uh, real estate person extraordinaire, Terry Murphy. And be sure to check her out, terrymurphy.com. Give her a big like. And speaking of like, give this video a like comment and by all means feel free to share it. So let's get into it. Client appreciation events are awesome. It's a great way for you to get up and close and personal with your clients, create a buzz of excitement and show them that you really care. But the difference between a good event and a bad event is the planning. Well here are nine, nine things that you can do. So the first one, number one is to build a VIP guest list. Make sure that you invite people, send them a nice invitation, make them feel special. So get a, a pen and paper or your data database, your CRM, and who are the top clients that you know that you really appreciate, make sure you invite them personally. Point number two, make sure that you plan the event, not haphazardly, but how do you want it done? Do you want entertainment? Is there going to be food? Are you going to cater? And speaking of food, reach out to some of your sponsors, your affiliate partners. Do you have a title company, a lender that you use? Having affiliate partners involved is a good way to showcase them, but also to get some money involved. So you can put on a better event, an even better event by having sponsorships. Number four is, are there things that you can do with the kitties? Can you rent like a kitty balloon village? You know, that kind of stuff. So it's fun for the kids. Another thing is uh, support a local charity. So you can have a client appreciation event, but the focus can also be on supporting a local charity. So there's a few things for the remainder. Check out the article that Terry has submitted for all nine and let us know how your next event turns out. Once once again, Michael Creasy here, executive editor with Agent Inner Circle from agentinnercircle.com. Give us a like, leave us a comment, and hey, invite us to one of your client appreciation events.